In this video, I'll be showing you how to get some shaders into Minecraft Bedrock to make your game look that more realistic and better. These shaders are really good for FPS and can improve your game performance if used well. Also, if you want to change your shaders, remember to watch the tutorial again and inject your different shader again. It won't work if you just open the MC pack. This is how to easily import shaders into Minecraft Bedrock. First, join my Discord server or click the link in the description and click shaders and go to the first link over here. Once you open this, you're going to scroll down and look for something called magic. You're going to right click it and click open link in the new tab. Once you're in the new tab, you can click code and click download zip. Once the zip has downloaded, you're going to scroll down a little bit and look for credits. In credits, in credits you're going to look for IO bit unlocker and click it. Once opened, you can click free download. You're going to start downloading over here. You can click open file and click yes. Then click next, accept, next, yes, next. And click launch, finish. Once it's done that, you can close this. Now, you're going to go back into the original link and look for any shader you want. All the shaders should work. I recommend looking for the newbie x legacy shaders and click cast verge as the easiest to download then click download over here and to eventually download over here after you have downloaded that you know go here minimize everything you can open file explorer and look go to downloads and look for that magic folder you're gonna keep Magix into your des desktop and you're gonna extract it. Once extracted, it's gonna open over here. You're gonna open this and open the bat file. If you open the bat file, show this, you're gonna click more info and click run anyway. I promise it's not a virus, it's really safe. Once you show this, you can press any key. show this welcome to magic for the first time it's in the key again if it's not working just keep spamming your keyboard or hit any key i recommend enter once you show this you can click yes type yes ah make sure to not use small letters make sure you're off caps lock or caps lock's gonna stop it from working any key and you key just tap enter easiest one to type yeah type in yes smaller to yes just type yes again oh why type y i mean my way type y again and type one download for me I type in Y again and start downloading. Download to whatever I very key. This is no matter for you, you're just chilling. You want to unlock. Type in Y. While unlocking, click run and click yes to everything it uh, shows. Wait in 30 seconds, 30 to 1, let's make it to continue. I want to show you here, where you're going to click here. You're going to click 1. And this is where you keep your empty pack. You're going to right click File Explorer again. Click File Explorer. You'll go to Downloads. And you're going to push your shader here. Any shader you want, you're going to move it here. Once you have done that, you're going to go back into the magic. That very key. And type in Y for magic to automatically import into Minecraft for you. And now choose anything here. You can just choose anything you want, it doesn't really matter. I recommend rounded clouds as it makes the game look 
kind of clean. Just type in six. And now, do you want to proceed with injecting? Type in Y, yes. And now, clicking, click yes to whatever it shows. Click OK. Click yes again. OK. To show the un unlocker stuff, just click yes to whatever it shows. Do you want to import MC Pack for full experience? Then just click Y. And show up in Minecraft for you. And that's it. You have your shaders into Minecraft Federal Edition. It's very easy, quite fast. And these are very good shaders. And they don't lag your Minecraft at all, which is very nice. Also, once you download the shader you want, like I downloaded a new shader called YSSRD. This one, yeah? You have to open this again. Open this. I run the bat file again. Now it should know you have used this before. So it should be way easier. You don't have to set up anything, all you have to do is just like inject it. So watch. It shows this. So you type in one, you click one to so open up the folder. In the folder, to so go to your so go to your downloads over here and just drag this into the YSSRD, into the MC Packs folder. Then go back into Magic and click continue. Again timing to show this, click two, then click the new one you just kept in, click enter. And inject it for you. Yes, I want you to inject it for me. And click. Depending on how good your PC is, new or your performance. I just use new because my PC is quite good. Do you want to put it injection? Yes. And to inject it for me. Click yes again to wherever it shows up. Okay. Click yes again. Just automatically inject it Minecraft for you. Click yes again. Click yes again. to import Minecraft for experience perfect it's that easy and now it's important to Minecraft now go to my settings click this disable newbie shaders click this and this shader looks a little bit better than the other one I used to use was less bright, I guess. Looks alright. And hopefully you enjoyed this tutorial. Make sure to subscribe. Also, if you don't like any of the shaders in this video, to remove a shader, it's even easier. All you have to do is open magic over here. Open the bat file. Again, click enter to verify the modules again. And now over here, all you have to do to remove all the shaders you want is click R shader removal tool. Click R. Wait, once you click R, I recommend clicking one. Once you click one, Click one again. Once you click one, you click Y. Y. And just click Y to everything and it should work.